Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to another exciting episode of This is Bear Country. Um, Maggie over here. Oh, can you see her? There she is. That's our little bear. Yeah, we gave, oh yeah. Um, <laughs> we bought Maggie a harness. Oh boy. Yeah, uh, at first it was like, oh. It wasn't fun putting it on her. No, and now she's getting used to it. So she just woke up from a nap, came out. Well, let my wife pet her for a little bit, which is different. She doesn't usually like attention. Walked around the living room, went into the bedroom, checked it out. Now she's giving herself a, a bath real fast. And then I'm sure she's all this excitement is going to tire her out, and she's going to go take another <laughs> long cat nap. She has to make sure she can sleep with enough. Yeah. Maggie, do you use a vitamin? <laughs> a pill or something? I think she's like, oh, I don't have to nurse these babies anymore. Um, she'll still give them bath. Not often, and they don't actually always appreciate it. But, Especially John. Yeah. He's like, ah, yeah, I'm yeah. a boy. Yeah. So I'm going to show you, a, uh, I'm going to try and share this link to this video. Whoa is all I can say. Uh, we live in bear country and the bear in this video, there are two of them that I can see, they're black bear and that's the kind of bear we have. I think one thing it might help to explain is the demeanor, the attitude of black bear versus grizzlies. Grizzly bear just browns. Yeah, the brown bears, they'll just kill you. I, I saw a show once. You know, these people had uh, livestock cattle out, out in the field. And this black, uh, not black bear, this brown bear was huge when he sat up on his hinds, stood up on his hinds. And he just pushed this cow over. I mean, the cow didn't even try to, to run or anything. Like, but this guy is in a tree stand. Uh, and this first there's this bear at the base of the tree and then he starts climbing it and then he puts his nose up to the guy's camera and I'm like what the F is that uh, sorry but uh, bear if you were coming up a uh, tree stand that I was in you wouldn't be alive anymore that's scary and there were two bear but only one of them that I saw went up the tree and I'm like oh and they can climb and my wife and I have seen bear up here and they're not little things um, there's a video from pork fest uh, from one year where um, these these black bear get in the, the dumpsters and one of them just picks up a garbage bag a big old full garbage bag with its mouth like it's a nothing Something you and I would strain to pick up with both arms. And this, I remember of a pork fest they were having trouble with them. Yeah. You know, so, I mean, I don't want to sound cruel or mean or whatever, but I'm sorry if I see a bear, I don't care if it's a black bear or a brown bear, coming up the tree to, toward me, um, I'm going to make the assumption that it's going to attack me. What other assumption do you, and let's say it's not going to attack me, it's just curious, it comes up the tree, and once it, oh, your food, and then it decides to chomp down on me, or maybe it just wants to see what I am, and part of the way it sees is by biting me. I'm not going to take the risk. I'm not going to take the risk for my wife going through that either. If I see, a, I'm more likely to shoot a bear when it's further away from my wife than I am to shoot a bear that's near me. Um, but, um, anyway, so that, uh, I, I've got some news from my uncle today. It didn't surprise me. And it's not the weather news. But it just doesn't surprise me 
wonder why it took so freaking long for that diagnosis to be made of someone. But at least it was finally made. Uh, oh, yeah. Although it's possible that she's been diagnosed with that or something else in the past and she just like, refused. And she was even a psych nurse. Right. Um, as for the weather, I mean, you know, this is weather we just deal with. No, I mean, you don't go and act a fool and get out there and spin your tires and stuff. That's ridiculous. But, I mean, this is the weather we have. Well, uh, people in some places are, you get a little dusting of snow and you, you and you panic, and I'm like, yeah, well, we get 12, 12 feet of snow, and we're like, oh, well, you know, just another day. But they actually close schools and things up here. So that's, that says something. Now, earlier the snow was nice and dry. It was big flakes. But when, the last time I went out there when it was snowing, the snow was smaller flakes and it was wet. I don't like that. I don't like wet snow. Dry snow is fine. But um, anyway, so I just want to show you this bear video. Bye.